Hello everybody, it's your Mama's Nuggets, but you can call me Nuggets, and welcome back to another episode of Vanilla Minecraft from the RB Plays Community Server. How are you doing today? I'm doing fantastic. Standing on top of a bright orange box. Now I'm next to it. But welcome back to the server. Hope you guys are doing fantastic. We've got a couple of things to do today, and the first thing is... At spawn. Well, let's blink really quick, and by the magic of editing, we'll be there. Well, here we are at our lovely spawn town in the shopping district for the server, and today we are going to build a small shop. One that might not be open for very long. Well, alright. One that'll have two different things to sell. One of which might not be available for too long. It all depends. Where do we want to build this shop, you might ask? Uh, and I would tell you, I have no idea. So let's get up here for a bird's eye view of the shopping district. And try to think of where we could build that would be nice. And I'm thinking it's going to be back there. Hmm. I mean, it could be here. How many blocks we got? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Alright, so we're going to build here. Let's see if we can. I haven't planned this out in creative at all, so I'm not really sure how well this is going to work out or how well it's going to look, but let's give it a shot. Roll the time lapse. I said roll. Come on. Where's the music? There we go. All right. Time lapse time.
all right, guys. So we have a shop, if that's what it is. More modern art than a shop and fairly ugly, but whatever. I don't know. I was struggling for what type of thing to build. And, uh, you know, it doesn't scream glass shop, but it makes sense. Because that's what we're selling. We're selling glass. But we're also selling Pebble Deep Slate. For now. So we're going to put up some signs here. I had to figure out the build on camera. So hopefully you enjoyed the time lapse. Thought I'd just go with the Helix thing. And I don't know if I should put like two more in it or whatever. Then I thought that might be too much. So I just made them like three blocks thick. But it's pretty cool. I like it. So we're gonna gonna put a sign here. Uh let's see. Glad. Um three stacks for a diamond? Sounds good. Three. Three stacks. Four. One. Diamond. We'll see if we can get any money out of it. Sounds good. Bam. Bam. And, uh, just put Cobbled deep slate. Uh, one, one diamond per, or two, three. So cobbled deep slate. One diamond a stack, or Two diamonds for three stacks. I don't know how much that'll be kept stocked because that took a while and we'll show you why. But we also have one other thing that I want to do before we leave. Let's see. Let's make some polished slabs. And maybe some... Uh, some walls. See if we can do something funny. So there's our shop. I don't have a name for it. It doesn't matter. Maybe you guys can come up with a name. But Okay, I thought I saw something. Let's do this. Uh, Alright, I like the eyebrows, but the mustache, uh, I thought it might be funny as like a handlebar mustache type thing. Not not working for me. But, the mustache is pretty good. Uh, we could just do this. I would just give him a big nose. <laughs> yeah, there we go. There. So the smiley face has got a big nose. Actually, I wonder if this would look alright. No. <laughs> no, that doesn't do it. But I do like this. That's kind of funny. 
and he's got happy eyebrows, like <laughs> interested eyebrows. So we got a shop. It does look good at night, which is what I was hoping for. <laughs> and we played a prank on OJ's shop while we're at it. Because we've got some slabs left over. Let's put Oh, he's got that. So we put a nose <laughs> and uh, eyebrows on the B while we're at it. Why? Because, I don't know, looks funny. Like it. All right. So I'm going to head back to the base and show you one of the things that I've been up to. All right, so we're back at the base. We're outside of our starter house, which we're going to go in right now and go downstairs and show you what I've been up to and why we're selling some deep slate. So it's funny that Doc put out a video where he made a tunnel borer, only his was super long. I made a tunnel borer, but it's not quite as long. And I've used it quite a bit, as you can see. It doesn't even render in. So that's where we got all the cobbled deep slate from. Because mining it sucks. So this thing's pretty cool. It works really well. The exception to the fact that, um, I mean, if you want stuff like your ore, you've got to actually pick it up before it blows it up. It does blow up quite a bit of deep slate, more than uh, it... Probably as much as it does for you to collect. But, I mean, it still... Still works. I still have uh, probably a double chest worth even after I put three shulkers in the shop. So uh, I needed to get more of it. So that's why I made this monstrosity here. And it works pretty good. I mean, I did die once because it uncovered a bunch of lava and I was going to get some diamonds. And then I went to jump over the lava and I got caught on a lip and <laughs> fell into the lava. And then it wasn't fully exposed, so I was stuck underneath it. So that sucked. I had to replace all my stuff. But, well, not all of it. But the netherite stuff was still good. But you could see this insane tunnel. But it has exposed a lot of deep slate that I can now go to mine relatively easily if I wanted to. And, uh... Yeah, so that that's what I've been doing with my time. I really need to change this off a jump, but it was easier to build the machine to jump. So other than that, uh, I did some prettying up around the... Now the other beacon takes effect. Run fast. Zoom. Zoomies. Uh -huh. I, I did a little bit of landscaping. Around here, I added a couple of trees, and I filled in some of the dirt and everything else to make it look better so that there wasn't such harshness to it. Uh, there weren't any comments about ideas to put in here. Um, I threw some in that uh, I'll be using this week during streams. I'll probably use it tomorrow. See what we get. Uh, but I think... That one of our next projects. All right, so it's, you'd say that that was our starter house, I guess. That was that was the first house we made. It's where our bed currently is, but it's got some brewing stuff in it and everything else, and it's not. 
it never f- it's never felt like a house, right? I guess I don't do it, haven't done any of the interiors. That's only exterior in the base, really. But it doesn't feel like my house or my room or you know where my bed actually is. I spend more time in this uh, storage room than a storage facility than anything else. But I do have plans. Right up there on that mountain. We're going to build ourselves a mountainside house. I I was going to call it a base, but this whole place was my base. Basically, we're going to build a giant mountainside uh, mountainside mansion for my bed. And... I don't know, possibly like an armor stand with backup gear and some other stuff. There won't be a lot in it, but it's going to look fantastic. And I think that it'll look really nice up there in the mountain behind everything. It's going to be a cliffside mansion that uh, kind of has an overhang, and uh, it, it'll be it'll be nice. Something nice in the background. I don't know how it, well it's going to fit in with the fishing village, but we'll just think that, uh, I don't know, some rich people moved to the fishing village because it was quaint. But it'll look pretty cool right up there. Like a nice big uh, modern mansion. And then we'll have to go back to building regular houses and everything else. I do want to get a horse stable over here, even though I don't have any horses, but I'd like horses. But so, we're going to do that. But to do that... I need to get a lot of blocks. A lot of blocks. Like, a crazy lot of blocks. And I've done some initial designing in my test world, but I haven't done too much. We also need to fix this roof, which I think is what we're going to do to finish the episode, because this this is bothering me more now that I'm looking at it. Luckily enough, with the tunnel borer and mining, because of it, uh, I have a decent amount of copper. Look at all these blocks. So we can turn a ton of these into stairs. If I can find where I put that thing. Uh, I think this cut copper? Yeah. Hopefully, this is enough to do the house. I'm going to throw a bed down here because I have it in my inventory. Alright. I don't want to keep this here, even though it's a good idea to have it because I'm in here most of the time. But let's go replace a roof. Let's throw another little time left on here. It'll be a very short episode where we didn't do anything but a little prank and a little shop. But we're also going to fix the roof of this house. Alright, so I ran out of honey. We gotta go back to spawn and buy some honey for the last layer. As you can see, one of them already decided to start changing. But we ended up making more stairs than we needed to. Uh, I still have like two stacks of stairs on me. And then two more stacks of blocks. So it didn't use quite as many as I thought it would. But that's fine. Anyhow. So there's a little bit of base cleanup. Oh goodness, I fell. I should watch where I'm going. Eh, these guys will all spawn here eventually. Uh, other than that, I have done some AFK in at the Creeper Farm. Uh, we had six double chests of gunpowder. Uh, I did fill up some shulker boxes, and there's still, you know, some left. And we still have some glowing sacks and everything else. So that thing's still running. Uh, I worked out a deal with OJ the original junior for to give him uh, a box shulker box of gunpowder 
for a shulker box of paper. So I made rockets, which is nice, because I was getting low, and now I don't have to worry about it quite so much. I was spending, like, all my money, all my money, on rockets. It's not true. I've spent it on a lot of other things as well. Like right now, I'm going to go back and get some more honey if there is some left, because uh, we still haven't made a bee area yet. And I also still haven't done this, but lots of little things left to do, but there isn't a lot of little things left for me to have time to do for this episode. So I want to make sure I got you an episode out this week. I'm going to do some work tomorrow on stream at twitch.tv slash nuggets. So hopefully you'll come and join me. I do appreciate it if you do. And I appreciate you if you don't. Leave me some comments with some ideas of things that we might need to make or that you'd like to see me make or, you know, that the base could need or use that I can put into the fountain to get out in future episodes. But that is all the time I have. Thanks a lot for stopping in. I do appreciate it. It's your mama's nuggets, but you can call me nuggets. And I will see you in the next episode. Bye.